Well, Saturday of the Columbia game at halftime, uh, the Yale women's crew team will be honored on the field at the Yale Bowl. Not only the 2008 NCAA champion eight, but the 2007 NCAA champions. And with head coach Will Porter, it, how tough is it to win two, let alone one? <laughs> well, you know, that's a, winning one is, uh, is uh, the first time we've done it since 1979 in the modern era. So getting two back to back, it was just, uh, you know, remarkable. It was, uh, it was an amazing thing for these kids. But it's a, the core group was together. And I think, you know, when you have good athletes, they, they tend to do good things. So uh, we were lucky that we have, have the athletes in the program right now to have that kind of success. You've been the head coach here since 1999, and it's been a very strong program for that duration. What led to the championships in 07 and 08? Well, I think it's been a sort of a slow build. You know, uh, we, we did, uh, so much of college athletics is about recruiting these days, and you know, uh, we sort of built the foundation early on and, and got the program running in the direction we wanted it to, and then slowly we've been able to sort of bring higher level athletes uh, year after year into the program. And, as we build on that, then uh, you know the, the boat speed produces, and uh, then you're able to win big races. And so, uh, I think it's just been a slow, steady burn. And I think you know when uh, high school kids that are out there who are who are looking at potential places to go, they see that you can be successful, or you are having a level of success, then they they feel better making the choice to come to Yale. Uh, obviously, there's a huge draw to come here academically. We want to have the, the combination of both things, and uh, we've been able to build it, so now we're getting plenty of attention from some high-level athletes. You talk about those high-level athletes, and you look no further than Yale Women's Crew alum was rep representative in Beijing at the Olympics, and that must be great for the program. Yeah, that's, uh, we actually had two athletes there. We had one on the Canadian 8, uh, Ashley Brzozovic, who... Uh, I was, I, was, I was torn. I was watching the race and, you know, cheering for the, She was right in medal position right up to the very end and uh, got bumped into fourth place. But uh, Ashley graduated, let's see, in the class of 04. And, uh, and then we had a, our captain from 07 in that national championship boat graduated and uh, went straight on to the national team. And she was on the U.S. team and was a spare at the, at the Olympics. She actually didn't race, but it was pretty remarkable to be, she was one of the top 10 athletes in the country. And uh, many of the athletes that were on the U.S. Olympic team, this was their second Olympics. So they've been hanging around after graduation and this was, uh, you know, eight years later, they're still training. So really proud of both those kids and they did so much for our program here and it's just exciting to see them take it to the next level. And your, your captain now had a very interesting start to her summer. <laughs> very unconventional, but some time in the Marine Officer Candidate program. Right, yeah. She came, she, uh, she came to me and told me she was going to do that program. And, uh, and I was a little bit taken back at first because you don't hear many kids, you know, going right into the Marines. And she's pretty excited about it. Uh, uh, I think it gave her a great skills. I think it exposed her to th so many things that so many young people here don't necessarily see every day and uh, and she's an amazing person. She's very dedicated to uh, everything that she does. She wants to do it at a high level academically, athletically and she's very excited about th going on and being a Marine. Someone asked you to describe the Yale Women's Crew Program and what it means for someone who their four years in that. What would you say? Um, I think we, we really stress uh, family. I mean, I think we, we try to run our program in a sense that uh, we, we take care of each other. And I think that, you know, we've won some big races recently, but I bet the highlight of some of the things they think back on is just the camaraderie, the bus trips, you know, the, uh, the, the we're going to have a Halloween row here in a couple of days, which is a, a sort of a goof-off day at the boathouse, but, the, you know, the kids love that stuff. And, uh, you know, I think they, they look back on making some really good, strong bonds with their teammates that will last them a lifetime, you know, and beyond Yale, you know, and uh, that's a special experience, I think. Let's talk about Gilder Boathouse, one of the elite facilities in the country. Yeah. Well, let's see. It was built in 2000, and, uh, and, and you know, I have to kind of pinch myself every day. I walk into that place thinking I work in this, this facility. Uh, it's, it's a state-of-the-art facility. It's, uh, it was a... I think it was a $7 million boathouse uh, for the building and then an endowment to maintain it on top of that. And, uh, you know, it's just uh, more space than we know what to do with. I think uh, when any kid comes here to Yale and sees that boathouse, they realize the commitment that the university has to the program, the alumni have to the program. And it's, uh, you know, it's an exciting thing to be able to row out of a boathouse like that every day. And you talk about this Halloween row coming up and a bit of a goof off. And I might say it's been earned this fall because we talk about the NCAA champion in 08, but this eight 
hasn't lost a race this fall yet either. Right, we've been on a little bit of a roll this fall. We uh, we we start out here on the Housatonic, and our boats were able to win every race that they were in. We went to the head of the Charles, and we won three races at the head of the Charles. All three boats that we raced up there won their division. And then this past weekend, we were down at the Princeton Chase, which is a, a head style race at Princeton with all the teams from our league in it. And we finished uh, actually first and second. Our varsity eight was first, and our Second varsity was second, which is pretty remarkable accomplishment for them, beating out uh, all the other varsity crews from uh, around the league. It's an exciting thing. And our third varsity finished up 13th, which uh, put them at the top of their their uh, their league also. Coach, uh, final question. Just you've been here as the head coach since 1999. Has there been a bigger a biggest surprise or maybe uh, something you've enjoyed most about coaching this uh, this program? Well, I, I guess every year is different, you know. Coaching, you, you, people kind of think that you do the same thing over and over, and I guess every team is different, and the, so the dynamic uh, every year changes. I think one thing uh, that's that, that is most exciting for me is dealing with these students. You know, Yale students are, you know, they're pretty exceptional people, and they're some of the best and brightest people. And it's the uh, it's the relationships and the dynamic that you have year in and year out with these young people. Yeah, you know, I guess it keeps me young, but I'm not that old yet. But I, it definitely keeps me young and keeps me going. So. Uh, you know, nothing jumps at me, no surprises. Um, I guess, you know, I'm always kind of, uh, when I step back and get away from it in the summers or when I'm away, I look at it and I do see that what we do is pretty remarkable uh, for these students to achieve at such a high level in the classroom. And then with our sport also, you know, being able to excel on a national level. It's, it's, uh, it's pretty remarkable the amount of work that these guys do. Well, Coach Will Porter, thank you very much, and congratulations, and we look forward to seeing your team honored at halftime of the Columbia game. All right. We look forward to it, too. Thank you. That's Will Porter, the head coach of Yale Women's Crew.